back to Let's Play Europa Universalist 3 Divine Wind with your host, Sharner, currently playing as Bihari Hindustan. Hindustan and our little face. This is part 37, and I don't have any amazing plans. I haven't really played any since the last video. I, I think I played like four days or something. I don't know. But, uh, need to go dock these guys up in Shanghai. I think I have some. Yeah, my Chinese, oh, that's my Pacific fleet. Where the hell's my China fleet? That is my China fleet. I'm an idiot. Where's my Guangzhou army? They're over here, aren't they? Yeah, that's what, that's what I did with them. Because so I'm going to go kill some, some naughty natives who are rebelling against me. Wow, I'm getting some bad lag. There we go. I'm uploading video 34, and I'm... Hold on one second. There we go. Anyway, I'm uploading video 34, because video 32 finally worked, and then video 33 worked on the first try, and now video 34 looks like it's going to work on the first try as well. So something either got fixed on my end, on Comcast, or it got fixed on YouTube's end, because shit just seems to start working all of a sudden. So hopefully it'll keep up. We will see. Anyway, in the meantime, we just finished some wars over here, didn't we? Yeah, and I have all my armies over here. I, mean, I got a lot of armies over there. Two here, two here, three here. One, two, three, three here, and another one down here. So four right here on this front. I got a lot of armies over here. Shit. Oh, I have this one in Thrace as well. Damn. And uh, my current goal is to get my infamy, I mean not my infamy, my inflation down under uh, under 10 because I just realized that I have a gold standard that I can implement with my Master of Mint and my inflation under 10 I can implement the gold standard which gives me a permanent in, an inflation reduction of uh, 0.04 that's almost half as good as the uh, National Bank idea almost half as good still very good, definitely worth getting now what the hell was I doing here in China? We just took some provinces, didn't we? Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going through the trade map mode, and I realized that our Han Yang center of trade, right here, is over 800, which means we can make a new center of trade. But the big question is, can I move my national focus yet? And I can. Very cool. So we're going to move it to Guangzhou, and we're going to make a center of trade in Macau. Come on, select it. There we go. Wow, this lag is pretty bad. What did I just do? Did it work? Hello? Macau. Oh, man, I shouldn't be doing so many things at once with my computer. This is not cool. Alright, make a center of trade. Yes. Alright, new center of trade. Very cool. There we go. Brand new. Right on the coast, so we're going to get even more uh, colonists from that. Look at all those colonists we're getting. It's ridiculous. Let's go ahead and start sending our merchants there. Come on. And eventually I will get rid of this Han Yang center of trade. When it drops below 500, I can delete it. And uh, the reason I want to delete it is because it's not on the coast. Like this one up in Beijing, it's almost at 800. As soon as that hits 800, I'm going to make a new center of trade here in Haichi. And the, the reason you want to keep doing this is you get more colonists, so it's it's really worth doing. Oh, this one's at 900, but I can't move my, my national focus now, so this will be the next one I do, since it's already above 800 uh, gold. I'm surprised that's so high. Oh, they're including these. And these go through... Lima. Interesting. Who owns Lima right now? Looks like Aragon owns Lima. They do. Wow, this this is so laggy. <laughs> Alright, well I guess I shouldn't do anything intensive like wars in this video, huh? This is going to be an all peaceful video while I wait for Infamy to go down. How did war exhaustion wind up after the end of that war anyway? 5.4. Not bad. You guys landed, attack those natives, those guys are bastards. And what about Pueblo? They look like they might want to attack. These are the nasty ones though, 2500 and their aggressiveness is 9. We're going to have to kill them. Same thing over here. I'm just going to kill the aggressive ones, 3000 aggressive 9, yeah. So, you know, 
Time to kill. Actually, what I'm going to do is split in half. And half of you will go back to Yaki, and the other half will go Rampage. Reason being, the support limit is very poor over here, so... Oh yeah, did I show you that in the last video? I think I did. Uh, Colombia, Paraguay, and Brazil are all independent now. That's kind of cool. Nothing I really want from them, but let me see if I can give them access. No. Can I give you access? No. Can I give you access? No. Can I give you access? Oh, I did. No, I give... What about Canada? Can I give you access? Maybe. So it looks like the U.S. lost Labrador and Micmac, which is this. Oh, sucks to be the U.S. All right, we're colonizing successfully. Canada is allowed. Abruzzi. Syria annexed hedges. That's nice. Hedges, hedges, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Revolts. Kane is sponsoring revolts. They're just pissed that we take over so much of their land. Look how much Kane is left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's all you have left, Kane. Seven territories. I will get them because the game will eventually give me cores on them, and then I'll be like, ah, cores. Achilles and Aragon. Who cares? Don't care. All right, you guys landed. Kill those natives, bastards. And then kill these natives, because they're bastards too. Now, the moment I get Comanche as an actual territory, I will go to Jicarilla, but not until then, not before then. Damn, I wish some of these natives would actually be alive, but they're all dead. Bastards doing the same thing I do, you're killing all the natives. Um, well, we killed some pirates. It's nice. Oh, my ship arrived. Start patrolling up to here. And does this port good, this port or this port is already in a thing that I patrol. Wait, do I patrol the coast of pepper? No I don't. I need to start patrolling the coast of pepper. How did I not notice that? Alright, you're gonna go there and then over the coast of pepper and then back up. That's gonna be your patrolling triangle. How did I not notice that? Oh well, whatever. Oh, they're dead. Kiowa. I guess that's Iowa? Maybe not. I think Iowa's up here. Yeah, Iowa's like... Iowa's over here somewhere. Anyway. Kansas we go. Whatever. Wales is independent. Hey! Whoa, Wales got all of this? Really? Look at that, Wales got four territories, and none of them are even in Wales. Man, that is so messed up. Gained a core in Handan, gained a core in Haifei. England has collapsed. Well, yeah, I kind of noticed. Can I give you access? Yeah. They refused. How rude. Can I give Tyrone access? No. Can I give Scotland access? No. Oh look, the Kansas natives are dead. I think that's far enough. If I need to kill any more dudes, I will be able to easily. Alright, so who can support 10, 5, 17,000? Oh, Pueblo can. And so can Comanche. Go to Comanche. Actually, go this way to Comanche. I don't want to accidentally kill these guys and then have them take the territory and then not be able to incite rebels. Get it? Chile and Brazil are at peace. Well, that's good for everyone. Alright, Chile, finally you're going to take that shit back. And... Oh, those are the La Plata guys. Right, right, right. You know, Chile would just finish this war... Ooh, I have a, I have a colonist. Oh, Guillen? What the hell are you at war with? Aragon. Is it a defensive war? Let me take a look. 
Once you click that shield, there's no going back, so I need to see if there's a defensive war or not. It is an imperialist war, which means I might take infamy. I mean, I might take a stability hit, and I'm not willing to take a stability hit. Yeah, good relations, military access. I can't do it, Guillen. Looks like I'm going to lose an ally. Sorry. Actually, I'm not sorry. You guys are dicks. Bye-bye, Guillen. It was nice knowing you, sort of. Oh, that's right, colonist. Colonist! Go there. And what's going on down here in Chile? Come on, you guys are really slacking. You let La Plata get three territories. Venice is war with Paraguay. Venezuela is at war with Paraguay. Aragon is at war with Paraguay. Interesting. Gained a core in Africa. That's nice. Also interesting. All this in Venice, Grenada. Grenada will null treaties. Who cares? Chile is allied with Morocco. <laughs> I can see they have a lot in common. <laughs> Alright, you guys are there, you're just gonna chill. It's my Guangzhou army over there. North America. I should make a North American army. Do I have enough force limits to make a North American army? I do. By one. I, I would be 850 out of 851. <laughs> well, I do have a core here in Los Angeles now, so... Actually, why don't I make an ATK army over here? I don't really need the siege. No, I'll make the siege. No. I can make two ATKs, which would be 30,000, or I can make a siege army, which is 35. I'll make the siege army, whatever. Oops, too many. There. And then when they're done, I'll bring all my dudes out of here. Are you guys going to finish this fucking war with Portugal? Finally, white peace. After all of that, you guys got white peace. You had all of this, Chile. You guys are pussies. Straight up pussies. Who are you at war with now? Morocco, Aragon, and Austria. Do I still have a truce with Austria? Please tell me yes. We have a truce. Then I get the feeling they won't be... They won't be joining in this war of reconquest. Who's going to join me? Everyone's going to join me. Let's go to war. Did I build my fort here yet? I did. That makes me happy. You're going to here. And you're going to here. And you're going to go... I don't care where you go, because I have forts. I have forts. You get it? It's true, I have forts. Oh, see, here's here's the good news. Everyone joined on my side, and Morocco dishonored. Hmm. I think all my buddies are landlocked, though, so they're not really going to help. Oh, we built some buildings. Good for us. Naples warned us. Oh, no. I feel so threatened by Naples. Yeah, yeah, I know I'm converting you guys, and you're all pissed about it. Alliance against Humford, don't care. Tuscany and Scotland are at war with Haiti. You hear... That's something you hear every day. Tuscany and Scotland are at war with Haiti. Yeah. All over the news. I gotta pause a second. You ever start recording and then figure out about halfway in that you've been recording to the wrong hard drive the whole time and the lagginess you've been complaining about is because that's the hard drive that you use for all your video rendering and it shouldn't be having uh, fraps recording to it while you're fucking rendering videos from it? Yeah, I just did that and I'm kind of dumb, so it's recording to the correct hard drive now, so the lag should be gone. Anyway, yeah, you guys are all set and I'm building a new army in Los Angeles and I have stuff to build, and I have colonists. Alright, it is going to be laggy while I am transferring files from one hard drive to another. It says 19 minutes remaining just to transfer 23 gigs. Jeez. 
Anyway, I can play through the lag. I can do it. Uh, bigger fort? Actually, where, where should I colonize for it? Here. No, nope. you have one going. You have one going, and there we go. Perfect. Now, for buildings... Come on now, you can pull it up. You can do it. I believe in you. There we go. Can I build level 1 forts anywhere? No. Can I build a port anywhere? Or a dock? Whatever it's called. Dock. 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 And we're good. <laughs> now it says 35 minutes to finish transferring the, the file. Alright, we finally caught up to Chile. Come on, lag, go away. They're dead. Level 1 fort? Yeah, siege it. Siege it, please. Yes, that means assault. There you go. I knew you could do it. Come on. There you go. Go here. Alliance against Utrecht. I don't really have anything I want them to do. I can't even make them spit anyone out because Munster was kind enough to revoke all the other people's cores. No more. Meissen collapsed. Hmm, oh no. I would love to see someone like Burgundy collapse and just <laughs> spit out a buttload of, of countries. And Austria, too. They can spit out like four or five countries. And Bavaria, I'm sure, can spit out a ton of these little one-state uh, one countries. Medical profession, what does this do? Ah, population growth. Cool. Are we making any progress down here? La Plata's independent. What the? What? So, they don't even have to take... They don't even have to conquer your land. They just instantly become independent if they have a core there. That is good to know, especially since these are my lands and you can't have them, and I think you're at war with me. You are. So it's time for me to fuck you up. And I'm gonna go over here instead. This lag is getting a little painful. Um, full conquest of Cuyo. And nationalism against... Ah, so I do finally get nationalism and religious liberation. But since I didn't declare war against them for those causes belly, I don't think I can claim those territories with those, with those causes belly. Kind of silly, because the war was forced onto me. I didn't choose this war with La Plata. They just spawned on my territories, and now I have to try to get them back. And the only way I can get them back is taking eight infamy, which is ridiculous. That is insane. I did not know that that's how that mechanic worked. Whoa, no, this. I was unaware of that mechanic. How they just spawn up and they get your land, even though they don't have any armies and they don't have to actually declare war, it's just automatic. That is a little bit crazy. So, under the Religious Liberation cause of belly, I can get territories at 25% infamy, which would be great if I could actually declare war, but I couldn't, so I can't get that, uh, that wonderful deal. Oh, I lost my, my great dude. 
So I can't get that deal when I want peace. So it's going to be a real shitty peace because I have to take infamy for it. I don't want to take infamy for it. Yeah, my poor diplomat died. The diplomat always dies. If you ever have a diplomat in your employ, they will die. One sec, what kind of peace do you want? Hello, white peace. No, you're a dick. I do want peace with Chile, because I want just one territory. I want that. It's my core. And they won't accept it. Why? Why won't you accept it? It's my core. It seems kind of silly. Fine. I will march on and keep taking shit. Stability finally went up. I gotta fix all that shit. Come on. Land can go... Actually, they can all stay even. That's fine. Grenada is at war with me? Oh. Okay. Lose stability or gain inflation. Uh, I think I can handle gaining inflation, but in the meantime... Let me do a little soul searching and see if I'm below 10. I'm not below 10 inflation yet. Alright, so just give me some fucking inflation, you goddamn game. Always with the inflation. Like I'm doing anything to cause inflation somehow. I thought I'd been playing a pretty conservative game as far as, far as inflation goes. All right, what's going on down here? Hello, Grenada. You guys wanted war, didn't you? Oh, I'm still here. Hello, capital. Bye-bye, capital. Poor Grenada. What's going on? Oh, we landed in wherever this is called. Come on, lag. There we go. Siege it. the territories that we want, what will they do as far as peace? They're going to be four infamy each, aren't they? It's going to be twelve infamy, isn't it? No, it's going to be nine because it's a defensive war. <sighs> See, one option I have is to just get white peace with them. And if I do that, I could keep my units safely down here in Chilean land, while well, I'll take this from Chile. And then after five years, I'll be able to go back to war with La Plata, and I'll get this one and this one. I'll get this one and this one for one infamy each, and then I'll get this one for free. So I'll be able to get three territories for a total of two infamy, if I wait five years. That's assuming nobody else conquers the land. So, you know what? I'm willing to wait. So why don't you guys revoke some of your cores and stop being dickwads? That's so what you guys are, by the way. You guys are fucking dickwads. Oh, I can make you revoke all your cores and all that shit? Cool. Yeah. Yeah, stop being dicks. You don't have any money, so... 
We're gonna go chill in uh, Chilean land. Actually, we're gonna go we're gonna go down here. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I didn't want them to seed anything. Oh, no. How did I screw that up? You know what? It's the 3rd of January. I am going to load that save because I totally screwed that up. I'm sick of screwing this up. I'm so bad at this fucking game. This lag is pissing me off, too. I did not mean to take those two territories. I did not six in from them. Come on, lag. Still got 13 minutes left on transferring those files. <laughs> oh, come on, lag. Come on. This ain't cool. You know I didn't want those territories. I've got some decaffeinated coffee here. Which, uh... Tastes a little suspicious, but since I bought a ton of it, I better fucking drink it. <sighs> wow, come on. How, how much sand can that hourglass have in it, for reals? Alright, screw it. I'm going to pause it here, and then I will bring you guys back when I get back into the game, and it'll be January 1st instead of January 3rd. I'm only going back two days, and it's so I can fix that stupid deal. All I want them to do is revoke their cores. I don't want them to give up any territory. But I was dumb, and I'm sick of being dumb. Pausing. Alright guys, welcome back to the Magical Time Travel. I'm about to bring you two days into the past. Uh, my upload is still working. That, that's magical as well. It's going at 650k. The files have moved over to the proper hard drive, so let's hope the lag is gone. And here we go. And let's see if I can avoid doing something stupid. Yeah, the lag seems to be gone. We're good. I just can't believe I did that. That's the second time I've done something incredibly beyond retarded, you know? In the, in the past, like, three videos. I just hate doing stuff like that. Oh, excuse me. Alright, so we're done. I want peace. Don't want your land. Just revoke all your cores. Revoke the cores. And uh, give me some money. And you'll accept. So yeah, there we go. And now we can finish up Chile. You guys keep all your crap. And then... Uh, oh, I should leave Grenada, huh? Oh, that's a separate war, huh? Oh, cool. Forgot about that. And I think I'm going to take... I'm, I have to take Wilopu. I have my core here. And they will accept this time. Yeah, just revoke some cores. And get rid of your alliance. And... Oh! I should get a separate piece with Granada. Go on. don't like being converted. Nobody likes being converted. Deal with it. Alright, go home. We have 100% on Granada. What can I demand from them? Get rid of some cores. Get rid of your alliances. Give me some money. I do like money. And I don't want your territories foreign for me. No way. Alright, Grenada's at peace. Now can we get our... We can. Good. Invoke your cores. Everybody wins. Everybody's happy. And I get to keep my boats here. Which is perhaps the best part of the deal. Cool. And this province has gold! So... I can send my missionary there. In a sense, what we did was we traded this and this unwillingly. Unfortunately, we, we lost some coffee, but unwillingly we traded these so that we could get some gold. And now we have religious liberation for 25% infamy for these two. Or I could do nationalism for 50% 50, 50 for all of these. Or I could do reconquest for 0% for this one. So 
we'll look at our options in 1770. But for now, I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of upset the way the mechanic works of where of how the the upstart countries just spawn out of nothing and they they get your land and you have no say in it. And they don't even get an army. They just they should at least get an army, you know, whatever. Uh, Kandar. No. You're an idiot, Kandar. Besides, I plan on attacking you very soon, so... You guys support? Yeah, you can support 35. You're good. My only worry is how much of uh, how much of La Plata will even be left when uh, I'm ready to go to war. They could all be gone. Akalea could take it all. You know who knows. Oh, again with the national decline. What what causes this anyway? I should go down here and look at triggered modifiers and see if I can find national decline. I don't have any modifiers triggered. What's mandate of heaven? Revolt risk minus 5. Stability cost minus 10% and stability investment. What do I need for this? No factions? What's a faction? Celestial Empire. That must be for China. I can't do that. Celestial Empire is only for China. What's Imperial Integrity? Part of the HRE, gotcha. Um, the Petrarchy, what's the Pentarchy? Rome, Thrace, Aleppo, Judea, and Alexandria. Huh. And I have to make them Orthodox. Is there anything for Hindus? Crusade, can't even do that. Overextension I can get, I know that one. Can't do Western arms trade. Conquest of Rome. Hindustan is not Catholic. Oh, so if I own Rome, I get yearly missionaries plus 0.5. Huh. That actually sounds kind of cool. Oh, Jerusalem and Mecca, same thing? Oh, you have to be Christian for Mecca. And you have to be either Christian or Muslim for that one. But Rome can be any, any religion. Oh, okay. East Indian trade route, have quests for the new world. Huh. <laughs> Bosphorus, Soundtoll, Adern, Bursa, Thrace, and Bithynia. Interesting. And the other Soundtoll. That's up in Denmark. Okay, so. Oh. I never really looked at what those trigger modifiers were before. Losing cost of spelling re is on, who cares? Province decisions, what are they? Local customs, go to hell. La Plata and Chile are at peace. Okay, good. Now you need peace with Akalea. Where is La Plata's capital? It should be here in Rio de la Plata, but you don't own it, so their capital is here in Pampas instead. So you're losing pretty bad to Akalea if they have your fucking capital. And this is Milan invading Brittany. Interesting. Anyway, we have stuff to build. Level 1 forts? No. But at least the lag is gone, right? Road network does trade income plus one, local movement speed. Well, can't hurt. Can't hurt. Can't hurt. Can't hurt. Salt. I do like salt. Venice and Chile are allied. Good for you. What was I going to do? I forget what I was going to do. I was going to do something. Oh well. Agricultural revolution, base tax, of course base tax. That's what I was going to do. I was going to merge my armies. Lake Winnipeg. Who cares? Discovering lakes is so silly in this game. 
like discovering any of these lakes makes any difference at all in the game. It doesn't. Discovering Lake Winnipeg up here doesn't make any difference either. It's... whatever. It seems kind of silly to discover lakes. Like, let's say I have this territory right here, this one. Then you have one, two, three, four, five, six. You have six territories bordering you. Two of them are lakes. So you have a random option of discovering one of these territories around you every month. So let's say this month I get a random success. Then it picks one of these six territories and it discovers it for you. Who the hell wants to discover a lake? You can't do shit with a lake. Oh well, look at USA invading Burgundy. It's kind of cool. And they just surrendered. USA said peace with Burgundy. USA will cede Quidditch. Why? You were winning. You were winning. You don't have to surrender. You were winning. Eh, whatever. We got a colonist. Go here. Let's see, this one's at 560, so we're gonna hit we're gonna hit a thousand first. Very cool. This one's at 760, so they're gonna get Oz they're gonna get Kapaw, and they're probably gonna get Ozark. But I need to get Kansas. So I need to colonize both of these and then get Kiowa and Kansas. Yada 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 yada. Uh-huh. Aragon, Akalea, Aragon will see Grain Coast. Who cares? Uh, Aragon will cede Rusalon, Girona, Pereno, Barcelona, and Adana. Whoa! Aragon, you just gave up your homeland. All of it. To my old ally. Now I border them. Hmm. I have liberation causes, Belle Young Guillen. That is freaking awesome. Good job, Guillen. You're only at 10 of 25, 2, is anyone over the limit? I don't think anyone's over the limit. Tarnished, nah. Slightly tarnished, nah. Nobody's over the limit. Bavaria's at freaking zero. That's ridiculous. Peru collapsed, and nothing spawned out of it. Yeah, yeah, everyone's allied with everyone. Collection, is this guy any good? Yeah, he's pretty good. I'll keep him. I wish it was a better diplomat, but whatever. Anything we can do anytime soon. Abolition of Slavery Act. Gain prestige, innovative plus one, national tax minus four percent, stability minus one percent, intimate. Eh. Have more buildings than one. Huh. <laughs> and a sheriff. What's this do? Production efficiency plus, ooh, merchants, merchant chance, compete chance. Oh, that is, that is epic. I need a sheriff. Can I kill anyone and get a sheriff? Yeah, I could, I could do with a new, new guy. what the hell's a sheriff? Philosopher, blah, 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 blah. You guys are not sheriffs. There's a sheriff. National tax modifier. Okay. I'm going to swap you out. Get me a little sheriff there. And now we can do that thingy. Pass Mining Act, which gives a little less merchants, a little less merchant chance, a little less compete chance, but production efficiency goes at 6%, national tax goes at 5%. That is awesome. What else can we do? Monopolies, no, I don't want that one. Anti-piracy, don't really want that one. Gold standard, I want that. Abolition of slavery, nah, not that big a deal. But I want gold standard, so... I have my Master of Mint, but my inflation keeps going up because I keep getting stupid events that make it go up. I'm not doing anything to make it go up. This is just so weird, seeing uh, Canada on top of Quebec and Quebec underneath the US. The US is pretty much in Quebec over here. This is weird. Ethiopia is independent. Look at you. Do I, have, I don't have any cause of belly on you. Uh, population growth. Tribal conquest. Oh. Sorry, guys. I have a causus belly. Allies? Invade. Oh, whales just... 
Wales just warned us. I... I am speechless. Wales has warned us. Mecklenburg will release Bremen. Wasn't Bremen already, already released? No, that was over here. Where's Bremen then? Oh, this is all Bremen. Oh my god, Bremen got four states. Wow. And none of them are actually Bremen. Oh well. Very cool. Hamburg. Hamburg defeated their old master. That's amazing. Mecklenburg is back to one territory. They used to have all of this. Wow. That is amazing. I'm amazed. Ooh, I have a colonist. Didn't even notice. Ooh, 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 crack in the neck. Naval tech, cool. And I need to spend my magistrates, but let me use my colonists first. Let's see, that will knock you over the 1,000. This one will arrive March. No, I might as well spend it over here. And my building. Buildings, buildings, buildings. Road network, road network, blah, blah, blah. Do I have any that are really high production? I do. Workshop, yep. Workshop. How is Los Angeles doing? Oh, you got a long way to go. Venice and Venezuela are at peace. Flemish nationalists. Oh, they're... Burgundy pushed them into our territory. How dumb is that? Oh, we landed in uh, some not Somalia, Ethiopia. See Egypt. We can. We converted the heretics of London. How fucking pro is that? Now we can actually build up the... F oh, well, if I had a um, magistrate, I could build it up. How many are we getting a year? Four magistrates a year. That's pretty cool. Give me a magistrate. Come on. You know you want to. Oh, wait. The siege is probably done, huh? Oh, they're already moving. Okay. Come on. Get there. Get there. Kanem, Borno, and Hausa. Who cares? Keep going. You're almost there. Alright. Four infamy? Four infamy. Cool. There you go. Wasn't so bad, was it? So these are worthless. Oh well. I am two territories closer to connecting up my lands. See? Sort of? Shut up. Anyway, go back to Mogadishu. Well, that wasn't long for a revolt. Wait, wait, pause. I think... I think Pueblo just finished. Oh, no, I was mistaken. Alright, need to build up my fort in London to a level 4. Very worth it. We converted Uyghur, whatever that is. Ooh, missionary. Pause it. Pause it. And missionary. I gotta stop neglecting all these people down here. Go there. Look at all these people I need to convert. All that shit. And these, all that, all this. Jeez, I'm so far behind the eight ball on that crap. Norway will see. We'll see the Ostgotland. Oh, that one. Mm, coffee. And now build Fort Level 6. What about these ideas? When do the newest ideas come out? Naval 53, Lantec 53. Lantec 53. Oh, both of these are 53. This one's production tech 53, tolerance goes up, and government 53, which allows you no cause ability required to attack pretty much anyone. That's kind of cool. Although I do already have liberation on everyone, but maybe, maybe that one, 
I should I should look that up, huh? Let me pause right here. Let me look up revolution and counter revolution and see about the infamy. All right, so it looks like revolution and counter revolution gives you the causes belly called revolutionary war, which is 25% infamy. So that's pretty freaking cool. That's like um, holy war causes belly. It's that good. So that sounds good to me. I will definitely rush that as fast as possible. What's my government at right now? 47, I think. Oh, that's Tasmania, isn't it? I think that's Tasmania. It is. How many cores do we have down here? A lot. We're almost done with cores down in this area. So yeah, government tech's at 47. I got a ways to go. Trade tech's up. Cool. Converted Valencia. Nice. Now I can start building up the walls there. Finally. Been waiting for that thing to finish forever. Comanche's almost done. That means I need another magistrate. Uh, exceptional year. Money or national tax? Yeah, just money. Oh, 12,000. Nice. Alright, hurry up, Comanche. Finish so I can build a wall. All right, now we're talking. Wait, you didn't, you didn't finish. Oh, you guys suck balls. But I think I can safely go here. Chile is at war with Aragon and Paraguay. Okay. Yep, natives are dead. And bingo. Whoa, what's all this? Canada collapsed. A lot collapsed. Government tech 48 and Hungary collapsed and self-sustaining colony build a fort and colonize here hooray we beat them to Jicarella that blocks them off from these two now if we're really really lucky we'll beat them to Ozark but I'm not I don't think we're gonna be that lucky because these guys are at 627 can't do much about it there's no natives Wait, does Mexico have cores here? No, no one has cores here. Mexico has core here. Ooh, I have, I have a, a fort here, right? I do. Should, uh, I should incite Mexicans, but I can't. Why not? Why can't I make Mexicans spawn? I should be able to make Mexicans spawn because there's no Mexicans anywhere and they have a core. This should be lit up right now. <sighs> Lame. I don't understand that. Oh well, we converted Ursa room. That makes me very happy. Look how much money that thing makes. And they're going to build a counting house. So they make 25% more money. Now I need to get rid of this horrible tax dude, but I'm at 69%, so I guess I have to wait. Medical profession, yep, 10% population growth in Mysore. How many people does Mysore even have? Oh, 146,000, okay. Seventeen sixty seven, so we have three more years till we can uh, go to war with La Plata. And it looks like they're losing to Akalea pretty badly. Hurry leniency, what's that say? Lose prestige or thirty percent no, I'll lose the prestige, no problem. And it looks like um Akalea is really kicking La Plata's ass, which sucks for us because Akalea could take all this easily. That's only nine infamy, you know? They wouldn't even think twice because they can afford it. They can afford 20 more infamy. <laughs> Lame. You're about to, no, you're not even close to finishing. Wish you could colonize faster by standing dudes here. Like you can in uh, Victoria 2. Stand some dudes here, they colonize faster, but it doesn't work here. Yay, 
Yay, magistrates. Love magistrates. Uh, fort level 3. Fort level 2. Fort level 2. How many of these conversion things popped up in this year, in 1767? Like five of them already? And none of them came up last year or the year before, but all of a sudden we just get this rush of uh, Pueblo. Do I want that one? I do. All of a sudden we just get this rush of conversion. I love it. Oh god, Burgundy annexed Friesland. Another revolt. Do we have war exhaustion? No, we have none. A few revolts. Our revolt things are pretty low. Shouldn't be revolting. And we converted more. Holy shit. Coffee. I better get used to this decaf stuff. Kind of tastes like shit, but I drink so much coffee, it's the only way I'm ever, ever, ever going to be able to sleep at night. Did that say a fort was finished somewhere? I think it said Fort in Valencia was finished. It did. Cool. Build it up. Alicante's already level 4. Alright, now I have a colonist, and I think I'm waiting for this one to arrive. January, September. Mm, maybe I won't wait. Very impatient over here. Besides, we're getting quite a few colonists. And we converted more. That's, that's ridiculous. We're getting so many conversions in 1767. So odd. Not complaining. It's just odd. And we have another missionary. Let's not let's not ignore Africa, okay? Breton Africa. Did that seriously say Austria did not have a Casus Belli? Austria started oh the Imperialist War. All right, so they do have a Casus Belli. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I get it. There's war and more conversions. This year is ridiculous. I didn't mistakenly hire one of these dudes that increases conversion rate, did I? I don't think so. Cool. Level 1 fort's done. Build it at level 2. And my colonists should arrive any day now. Counting house and earth room. Look at that. 146. It was 119, right? And it went up 25%. Man, that's nice. I gotta start on all the trade buildings. Ooh, that's such a nice territory. Seventeen sixty eight, two more years. Cool. Almost have a colonist as well, so we're ready to go. Come on. Send it. There we go. We're going to arrive in March. Takes a long time to get from India to America, so... Wait a minute, aren't you supposed to be in Shanghai? Why did you stay in Hanyang? There we go. So... Oh, that was just Portugal. So Portugal got Banda Oriental. Okay. That's fine. I just hope Akalea doesn't take all this. Which they probably will. And I'll be very cry. Religious uproar. 40% chance of two armies showing up. So apparently it didn't happen. Production tech. Very nice. Yeah, yeah, if you don't like being converted, deal with it. Yep. What's up? Ah, oh, I wish I had been recording during that whole conversation. <laughs> it ended with, next time maybe, <laughs> no, I can't say this on YouTube. <laughs>
Anyway, what were we doing? I don't remember. Look at Austria go. Poland. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, forts. Cool. I like forts. And <clears throat> I'm not sure this is a good idea. Hungary, faithful ally, come to aid in the come against Ukraine. Well, if I don't take a stability hit, I don't mind it. Oh, there. Feel better now? Wait, am I at war with Yaros? Pause it, damn. Oh, pause it. Quebec is the leader of this war. I'm going to repeat that. I just declared war on Ukraine, and Quebec is the leader in the war. Wow. Cologne is now independent. And apparently I'm at war with Yaroslavl, I just didn't even notice. So, we're just gonna invade, I guess. Nothing else to do. Ooh, I have a colonist. I should pause. Pause, please. Pause. There you go. Peru honored the war. I don't border Peru, do I? No, they're up there. Man, what a weird little, like, world war this is. It really is a world war. It's just crazy. Anyway. That's a big army, 36. Alright, Siege Kiev. Yep. Oh, I can't get them out of the war. Oh, I'm a junior partner, so I have to deal with Quebec. Can I go there? No. Alright, go up here. Whatever. Oh, I should go put my colonists somewhere. Uh, you're about to arrive. I'll wait for you. Guillen honored the alliance. Oh, well, guess what, Guillen? I've got an army right here. Do, 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 do. Invading Guillen is so fun. Siege it. Oh, it's a level 4. Holy crap. What are these? Level 3, level 3, level 3. Why did I pick the level 4? Eh, whatever. Good luck. Yep, we got it. Cool. We barely lost anyone. We lost 300 guys. That's amazing. Siege it. Oh, wow. Austria is on my side for a change. Border friction on Keen. Nam chain on Keen. Don't I have a uh, truce with Keen? I do not. Ooh. Alright, I have to do that. Nanqing. Let me, let me take a look. I, I'll never remember that. Oh, siege, siege that in the meantime. Where are we over here? It's not Leo Dong. It's Raning, Anqing, and. Oh, so it's these three. Okay. Um, are you allied with anyone? You are, but I kind of don't care, so we're at war. Invade. Invade. I might as well be at war with these guys if I'm at war in Europe, you know? It's just how it works. So we'll see who joins that war. Oh, I should do something about my navy this time rather than being a numpty. So you're going to go there, and you're going to go sit here. Okay? We cool? So three territories, that'll be six infamy. I can handle that. I can handle that. It's a little more than I want, but whatever. Khmer honored it, Long Zhang honored it, and she honored it. Okay, so everyone's at war. Shen... Oh, Long Zhang, my bad. So I'm gonna go there, I guess? I don't know. Where are you going? I'll figure it out. This guy will probably go here and then here. This guy will go here and then here. This guy will do this shit, and this guy will do that. Okay, yeah, so that'll work. And is anyone big in this war? No, they're all small. So let me get my little Ration army and go. All right. Oh, we got Miram. Hold on. Let me go there. All right. Keep moving. You're gonna get there on the 22nd. I'll get there first. So that'll be my siege, bitch. You guys are all set. Oh, 
But I'm not at war with them. I'm not at war with them. Oh, my only target is going to be Khmer. And... Where is my little navy over here? I must have I must have lost it already. Holy crap. I didn't even realize I lost it. Alright, where are you going? Yep, I'm an idiot. I I am an idiot. Can I get peace with you guys? No. Can I surrender to you guys? No. You sure you don't want peace? Check again. No. Okay. Stop the job. Actually, I'll leave this one as bait. You are bait. You're going to go over there because no, you're going to go this way. You're going to be bait, okay? And they will most likely come right here. I'll just sit there. And then I'll have you come uh, like that. And then I'll try to live long enough until my navy gets there. Kind of sneaky, I know, but hey, if it works, it works. And you're going to go there, and then you're going to go there. Whatever. All right, we got Barcelona. Move to Perennio. Ah, um. Wow, you guys sure got out quickly. Whatever. Keep them involved, you know. Naval range, that's nice. Oh wow, we're winning? One versus two, and we're winning. They have Dong, Sea, Jit. Don't care. Whatever. Um, ah, okay, that's fine. You guys got on the boat. Good. Now that you're on the boat, go... Yeah, go here. Help me out with uh, Guillaume. This is such a weird war. Quebec is the leader. I guess we'll make Guillaume spit out somebody cool. No, I can't, because Quebec is the leader, so I can't make Guillaume spit anyone out. That's kind of shitty. What can I get? I'll just end the war if I can't get anything out of the war. Revoke some cores, but they won't accept it. They won't even accept white peace. Oh, they will accept white peace. I don't really want white peace. I'm already at war with Keen. I might as well get something out of it. Go back to Haichi. Um, you guys are going to arrive 22nd. So when the 22nd comes, then I'll see you. Alright, my navy showed up. And you're now going to go here. And you... I'm still winning. One against two. I'm winning again. I guess I had nothing really to fear. Alright, you're doing that patrol, and... You're doing some weird little skittish... Did I screw that up? I did. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Stop patrolling. Go up here. And I need a new boat down here. Do, 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 do. You go here. Okay. Siege it. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. See it. Right. What's going on? Okay, you landed there. That means you need to go like this. Do your triangle. You. I must have time running very quickly. If let me slow down time just a tiny bit. Oh, it's the 24th already. Oh, and they're, they're leaving instead of helping me. Well, they suck then. But I'll wait till the end of the month anyway, just get my morale up. You guys are almost there. Aichi's done. Stracy Johor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My, my dudes are fine. Yeah, yeah, one sec. Let me get my navy. Oh, I captured a ship. Doesn't matter. Let me get my navy back to... Shanghai. Don't need them anywhere else. Siege it. Siege it. And my 
damn boats arrived, so get off the damn boat. Oh man, you guys are so boned. You don't even know how boned you are. Uh, okay. Investments in production technology. Uh, I kind of don't want the inflation right now, really. What's my inflation at? Man, it's going down so slow. So I'm not going to take the inflation. Normally I would, but I'm not going to take it this time. Alright, go to Shia. Actually, Keen's the leader in the war. I don't even have to dick around with anything. Let's go back home. Keen's the leader. I didn't even realize Keen was a leader. And since they're the leader, you guys can go home to Handan. There's Handan. Nanchang is done, discovered spy, whatever. Go up to running. We're almost done here. That's what she said. And nobody is going to become the Shogun over here because this is just crazy. Or nobody's going to unite Japan. Of course they're going to have a Shogun. Okay, end of the month came. You can go ahead and siege. You guys just go back to Zaporozia, really. You guys are so dead. There we go. Go back to Kostroma. Are any of these level 2s? Level 3, level 3, level 4. Oh, we'll go there. Whatever. Sit there, I guess. And we can win the battles. The battles that need to be won. And of course we win the battles, and then we siege. Atlantic 51. Oh, my fleet arrived in Shanghai, that's nice. Girona is done. You guys should get the leader. You just get back on the boat. This was a this was a wash. Can I make Quebec release anyone? Probably not. USA, USA and Spain. Ah. Shawnee. I could make you release Shawnee. Maybe. It's only one territory though. Probably not worth it. No, can't make him release them. So, basically it would just be... Oh, I can make him give me something. Do I want any of this? Barcelona worth anything? It is wine. Wine is always good. It's got 500,000 people. It's probably a decent tax as well. Are these any good? Grain, grain. Ooh. Ooh, look at that, 188 gold. Ooh, that is good. Ugh, I'm not going to worry about it. I just don't want the infamy right now. So, yeah, let me get peace with you guys. There goes all your cores, but they won't accept it. They won't fucking accept it. I don't understand why not. I'm totally owning you guys. A 26% war score, and you guys are like, uh, no. We don't want peace. We don't want anything. You guys should just pack up and go home. That's what they're saying, essentially. They're telling us we're chumps. At least we can get peace with Keen and get our six infamy. Oh, they moved their capital. Or did they? I don't know. Where the fuck's their capital? No, their capital's still there, so why would they give it to me? Oh, they would give it to me because it's surrounded by my land. That's right. I forgot that you could do that. Alright, six infamy. Revoke cores. 
Get rid of your alliances. There. Done. And you're home. Shanghai, go home. You go home. Status quo. Very nice. Oh, poor Keen. You guys used to be awesome. Now you're shit. Not my fault, really. Alright, you guys back on the boat. It's very good. Go back to Grace. Don't need you. Oh, I have a colonist, and you are about to turn over. You are also about to turn over, but I will wait. I will save some colonists. Uh, human. Where is human? I'm going to have to type that in. Oh, that's the one in China. Never mind. I know where that is. That's part of King's little, like, stretched out left arm thingamajig. And you guys haven't ended your war because you're gay as shit. And who the hell is this? That's Paraguay is invading Chile. Wow, that's some crazy shit right there. And Europe is just a fuck. Look at this mess. This is a mess. Nobody stepped up and said, like, oh, I'm going to be in control. Austria's kind of doing it, but they're, like, way over here. Man, Portugal and Castile, Burgundy and Guienne, kind of sharing France. This is so weird. All right, let me build some buildings, because that's what I'm supposed to do. Bigger forts, please. You still haven't converted. I've had this guy in Aragon ever since we took the province. It's going to go core in 12 years, so that's... 38 years of converting, and I got London much sooner than that, and it already converted. A lot of these has already, have already converted. Still a few to do. That one, no, that one hasn't converted. The Poldava converted, like, within days. I mean, come on. Alright, fort, 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 fort. You're all level 4s. You're all level 4s. You're all level 4s. Nope, that one's not level 4. You're level four. I don't care about those. You're level four. You're you're converting. That's right. Ah, this is what I need. I need marketplace. All four of these will bring this number. Oh, look at that! It's up to two hundred and thirty-four already. Oh, so good. I'm sorry, but that is just one juicy territory. Wow, Jerome, I mean, they're actually standing there. They're going to get fucking raped. Look at this. Why did they stand? Now they're dead. Their whole army just died. Because they wanted to stand there and be brave. Well, now you're dead. You feel better now. Well, revolt. I'll deal with it in time. Hold on. Why am I the junior partner in this war, anyway? Hungary. Hungary is the leader. They have three territories. Three. And they are somehow the leader in this war. A little miffed at that, to be honest. Alright, siege it. Uh, yeah, siege it. Give it a shot. Alright, so we've done everything we could up in Yaroslav, so go back to Ka or Kostromon. And just sit there. Nothing else. Nothing else for you to do. Level 3 for it, all the way to the end of the month, I guess. I'm up to 30% already. Level 1, level 2, level 4, level 3, level 2. Alright, I'll go here and then these and then I'll stop. Actually, I'll just stop at this one. 
Whoa, pirate raid, rogue gear, whatever. Seize it. And then come back and get rid of this stupid revolt. Now the question is, do I want to take something here? Of course I want to take one of these. Wine is worth a lot. Well, fish ain't worth shit. Another wine. Another wine. Iron is worth a ton. And more wine. So they have a lot of provinces that are worth money. But, nah, Can't spare the infamy at this time, so... Let's see. Can we get out of this war? You still won't revoke a single core. These are some stingy bastards. They won't do shit. They won't give me shit. They won't do shit. They won't even give me money. Not even a little bit. So, uh, white peace maybe? They work. Okay. There. You're actually going to take a little different route. There. Catalonian nationalists. Is that a, does that say 30 units? 30 units of nationalists just showed up. Looks like that's going to be free territory. Alright. Keep sending to there. Let's see if I can beat them to a thousand people. Oh, you're at war. Brittany, very cool. If Brittany keeps this up, then uh, maybe these won't get colonized? Maybe? Cross your fingers, maybe? I'm hoping, man. I'm really hoping. This war needs to end, because I'm one year away from my war. Oh, we converted more of Amsterdam. Good. I'm one year away from my ability to declare war on La Plata again. One year, and then I could do all these wonderful little thingies. But if they're still at war with Akalea, I wouldn't get any of it, so what's the point? Oh, I have a missionary. Do the other gold province. Yay, more cores, and our colonist. Colonist! Go here. Come on, end this fucking war. We're converting people. We converted Thrace. Oh, that's that's a big one. 756,000 people. Oh, it's not bringing me any money, though. God damn it. Go Catalonian nationalists. Wait, you're going to Aragon. I don't think so, you little punk. 24th of July, 11th of July. I'll be there first. I'll get the defensive bonus and everything. Bastards, you stay out of my land. I got a missionary there and everything. Oh, I have four magistrates. Man, I like having this national idea for more magistrates. Look at that, 4.3 a year. That's pretty awesome. Level one force anywhere? Nope. Uh, ah, this is what I want. Counting house in Surabaya. That will bring in a lot of money. Counting house in Kandesh. A lot of money. Gotta remember to do all those. Alright, oh, they're still coming. Hey, you guys are brave. You guys have cojones. Negative one. Ah, we're gonna win. Yep. Go back to Barcelona. Good, they survived. That means they may go ahead and become a free state. I'm hoping they will. What? Oh, now they're fighting religious rebels. Rebels are fighting rebels. Isn't that awesome? And the Nationalists won. Barely. Alright, we have a colonist. Colonist, Munster. They ask this every couple years, and I always decline it, and yet they keep asking. And it would be really nice if there was a way to 
block a country from contacting you, or at least block certain types of contact. Like this contact is okay, but this contact is not okay. You know, stuff like that. Anyway, I gotta rush this uh, colonization effort over here. Really taking too long. Uh, yeah, don't be able to the fort yet, because I'm waiting on this one to core. I mean, not core, but uh, go uh, full province. Election. Yep, keep him. Wait, what was that? What was government boost? Government boost expired. No, I don't know what it did. I should have been paying attention. You guys are at 981. Come on, hurry up. Lame. There. Fujiwara collapsed. Really? Aren't they the big purple one? Yeah. What the hell happened to you guys? You got... This is a gold state. How can you collapse with a gold state? This shouldn't even be possible. <laughs> La Plata is allied with Trebizond. Wait, Trebizond is... Oh, that's right. Trebizond re-emerged there. I forgot about that. We annexed them, and then they showed right back up. Will you guys please fucking hurry and end this war so I can go ahead? Who's this? Oh, Bihari Patriots. Yes! <laughs> These are my guys. They want to uh, send the country back to me. Can I do that? Patriots, hell yeah. Cool, and up here. I forgot that you could do this when you have cores. Cool. The Ari Patriots, love it. Anyway, uh, oh, Brittany took these two. Oh, because they're colonies, they're not fully, uh, they're not territories yet, so when they stepped on the land, they got them for free. Well, not for free, they took a little infamy, but all they had to do was step on it. That's kind of cool, because it reduced their population by like 100, I think. Anyway, this one's almost done. There we go. Brittany will see Nicaragua, Mosquito, Honduras, Guatemala, and Zapotec. So, pretty much all of Central America. Damn it. But they didn't make them see Kansas, or not Kansas, Arkansas. Whatever. I just hope I can beat them to uh, Ozark. That will be a huge uh, benefit for me if I can. Patriots. That will be... I'll just do a revolt. USA declare war on Brittany. You guys even port oh you do border Brittany, okay. Good for you. Come on, hurry up, you're at nine ninety. Yeah, 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 I get it. Yeah, I get it, there's war going on. Uh Jukar oh yeah, that's this one. Of course. Wait, was that La Plata and oh, and France are that piece? Does that mean you're still at war? Yeah, you're still at war. Lame. Stop being at war. I want my land. Oh, there we go. Austria took land. Wow. Austria, you guys. Only 15 out of 32. And look at Austria. They're just pushing everyone around. Damn. Austria, you scary. Alright, well, I guess I need to end the video here. We're way over on time. But hopefully next time I'll see if these rebels will be successful for me. They are Bihari patriots, and I am happy for them. And I also hope... 
that I will be able to get to Ozark first so that we can uh, contain the Milanese and Brit and Breton expansion in North America. If we get to Ozark first, then I think we have a good chance of getting all these in here, which will be great. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time on Hindustan TV.